In the glittering world of Hollywood, where stars rise and fall with the changing tides of fame, few figures have captivated the public's imagination as enduringly as Lisa Bonet. Her journey through the entertainment industry is a tale of love, fame, controversy, and self-discovery. From her early days as a Cosby kid to her marriage to rock icon Lenny Kravitz and her recent separation from actor Jason Momoa, Lisa Bonet's life story is a testament to the complexity of fame and identity in the American cultural landscape. Lisa Bonet was born in San Francisco, California, into a diverse family background. Her father was African American, and her mother was Ashkenazi Jewish, reflecting the rich tapestry of America's multicultural society. Bonet's parents divorced when she was young, setting the stage for her unique journey through life. As the bright lights of Hollywood beckoned, Lisa Bonet's journey began at a remarkably young age. At just 11 years old, she took her first steps into the entertainment world, starring in commercials that hinted at the immense talent that lay within her. Her youthful charm and natural charisma hinted at a promising future, but it was her role as Denise Huxtable in The Cosby Show that would define her career. In the mid-1980s, Lisa Bonet landed the role of a lifetime, becoming Denise Huxtable in The Cosby Show. This iconic comedy series brought her into living rooms across the nation and made her a household name. Her portrayal of Denise, a free-spirited and independent character, charmed audiences of all ages. Denise was not just a character on the screen, she became a role model for young viewers and a source of inspiration for those who admired her spirit of individuality. While Lisa Bonet's star was on the rise, fate had a serendipitous encounter in store for her. It was during this period of fame that Lisa attended a New Edition concert in Los Angeles, where the melody of her life took an unexpected turn. In the crowd, she met Lenny Kravitz, an aspiring musician who would soon become the leading man in her personal narrative. Lisa Bonet and Lenny Kravitz's romance blossomed like a whirlwind, captivating not only their hearts but also the media and fans. Their love story transcended the confines of ordinary relationships. Both Lisa and Lenny, with their shared neo-hippie persona and biracial backgrounds, became a symbol of a love that defied conventions and stereotypes. Their secret Las Vegas elopement in 1987 sent shockwaves through the entertainment world, and the birth of their daughter, Zoe, in 1988, added another chapter to their remarkable story. The media's fascination with their relationship turned their private moments into public spectacle, yet their love remained resilient amidst the chaos. Following her departure from The Cosby Show marked a significant turning point in her career. Having portrayed the beloved character Denise Huxtable on the iconic sitcom, she had become a household name and an inspiration to many. Yet, the decision to move on from the show was a bold one, leading her into uncharted waters. Following her exit from the sitcom, Lisa's career faced its share of challenges. She found herself starring in B-movies, a departure from the mainstream success she had once enjoyed. This period was characterized by a shift in her professional trajectory, as she navigated the evolving landscape of her acting career. It was in 1992 that Lisa Bonet embarked on a journey of personal transformation. She began dating yoga instructor Brian Kest, a significant step that would influence the course of her life. As part of this transformative process, Lisa chose to legally change her name to Lilikoi Moon, embracing a new identity that resonated with her personal growth. Amidst the challenges of her career and the whirlwind of Hollywood, Lisa made a deliberate choice to prioritize her family. She shifted her focus away from the relentless spotlight and sought solace in the embrace of her loved ones. This decision led her to step away from the demands of fame, opting for a life that offered more balance and fulfillment. Following her decision to step back from the relentless demands of the entertainment world, Lisa Bonet found herself in a quieter phase of her career. Her reduced presence in the industry was marked by a deliberate choice to prioritize her family and personal well-being. While her star may have dimmed, her spirit remained undiminished. In 1998, Lisa Bonet orchestrated a triumphant return that sent shockwaves through the industry. She co-starred alongside the charismatic Will Smith in enemy of the state, marking her return to the big screen. The announcement of her role was met with eager anticipation, and when the film premiered, Lisa's magnetic presence on screen reaffirmed her status as a formidable talent. Her performance was met with critical acclaim, and audiences once again marveled at her acting prowess. 
It was a comeback that not only delighted her fans but also served as a reminder of her enduring talent. Two years later, in 2000, Lisa's resurgence continued as she took on a significant role in High Fidelity. This cult classic, based on the novel by Nick Hornby, allowed her to showcase her acting depth and versatility. Her portrayal in the film was not just a return to prominence but also a pivotal moment in her career. Lisa's performance in High Fidelity not only earned her critical acclaim but also solidified her place in the pantheon of American cinema. Her ability to seamlessly transition from the 80s sitcom Darling to a versatile and respected actress in the 2000s was a testament to her enduring talent. Amidst her triumphant return to prominence, Lisa Bonet rekindled a meaningful friendship with her ex-husband, Lenny Kravitz. Their bond, forged through shared experiences and artistic endeavors, demonstrated the enduring connection between two souls who had once been intertwined in love. Furthermore, Lisa's friendship with Cree Summer, her best friend and former co-star on A Different World, added another layer of depth to her life. This friendship extended beyond personal ties into the world of music and entertainment, where Lisa's artistic spirit continued to flourish. In 2005, the tides of fate brought Lisa Bonet into the orbit of actor Jason Momoa. Their meeting was a stroke of serendipity, the kind of chance encounter that Hollywood screenwriters often dream of. As their paths crossed, an unspoken connection ignited, setting the stage for a profound love story. Lisa Bonet and Jason Momoa's relationship deepened over the years, eventually leading them to the altar in 2017. Their wedding was an intimate celebration of their love, and it symbolized the union of two unique individuals. As they embarked on their journey as a married couple, they welcomed two beautiful children into their family, creating a home filled with love and laughter. The public watched with fascination as Lisa and Jason embraced their roles as parents and navigated the delicate balance between their thriving careers and family life. Their love story was a source of inspiration for many, proving that love could indeed conquer all obstacles. However, in January 2022, the world was met with unexpected news as Lisa Bonet and Jason Momoa announced their separation. This development marked another chapter in Lisa's complex love life, leaving fans and observers in shock. The intricacies of their relationship, once celebrated for its uniqueness and strength, had taken an unforeseen turn. If you enjoyed what you saw today and would like to stay updated on our future content, please consider subscribing to our channel. By subscribing, you not only show your support but also become a valued member of our community. Dot. Thank you once again for being a part of our audience. Your presence makes all the difference, and we can't wait to bring you more fantastic content in the future.